I've come across a great Mac app here. Um, it's called Drop Zone. I'll get straight to the point with this one because I realise that I talk for a long time at the beginning of my videos. It sits in your dock, it runs all the time, and you can just drag all sorts of different things onto it, and a little menu will pop up, and from there, you you can perform lots of different actions with whatever you've dragged onto it. So, for example, if you have a photo um, somewhere on your hard drive on your or on your desktop, and you drag it with like click and drag over to the icon in the dock and the drop zone icon the menu will pop up and then you could drop it on the zip and email icon um, which would obviously compress the photo and put it into an email for you um, you could drop it on the FTP upload icon upload it to your website with FTP and there's loads of different drop zones that you can install and use. And the default ones, I'll just list a few of them, would be our Flickr uploads, FTP uploads, you can save text to a text file, um, email files, install applications, which is a nice one, um, it mounts the disk image, finds the application inside, copies it to your applications folder, launches it, ejects the disk, and moves it to the trash, <laughs> which, if you install a lot of apps on your Mac, that could save you quite a bit of time and as well as the default ones you can also download more from the website and these include um, sharing photos um, with Twitpic, Dropbox, a print to drop zone um, you can set a photo to your desktop picture there's, there's literally loads of great time saving features about drop zone now this app costs ten dollars to register they have they have a free one and you c it doesn't actually tell you on the website it's it just says download you click download it installs you, you it doesn't explain what you're actually downloading it's a 15 day trial and with a maximum of five drop zones which is quite irritating because then you get three then two and you're left with a gap um, but I I think with the registered one you can have as many as you like and all the extra zones you can install extra actions um, are free after that so that's it that's a drop zone you can get drop zone from is it aptonic.com and the URL is just above my head aptonic.com and I've been using the trial I might register drop zone and some of the features are really really helpful and you really useful um, the one I liked most was the FTP upload if I needed to quickly upload a file to just the root directory of my site which I've been needing to do a lot um, because as you know I'm in the process of changing my domain and setting up my new website um, just being able to drag a file into the dock basically and drop it and have it automatically upload without launching any FTP clients is really helpful and saves me quite a lot of time and obviously lots of the other drop zones are really useful too so if that sounds like it could help you in some way aptonic.com um, download drop zone try it out if you like it you could purchase it my website now I'll have to make sure I don't tell you the wrong one here. JakeWright.net, my email address, Jake at JakeWright.net. Um, if you want to contact me, or you could just use the contact form at JakeWright.net. Also there you'll find my blog, my live stream, um, and lots more. Thanks for watching.